Hello and thank you for contacting Wave Support. I see from your request the lens that you've designed tends to drop inferiorly and dig into the inferior limbal area. If we look at your design, uh, one of the uh, difficulties we have, let's go back here to the topography, you'll see that that cone is slightly decentered inferiorly. So of course the lenses will have a tendency to want to center around that which will displace this lens a little inferiorly to begin with but secondly as you know from the power that's uh, required for this particular lens the inferior part of this lens is much much thicker than the superior part so no matter what you do this lens is going to have a tendency to drop the key to trying to get this lens to center and align uh, the best that you can is to try to get that lens to line up and match this peripheral part of the cornea as well as you can now keep in mind we're a little bit limited because much of this data is extrapolated when Wave uh, uh, creates this uh, lens. Uh, however, there's a couple things you can try. I notice you designed an axial, which is uh, sounds like it's working pretty well for the most part. You do have quite a bit of clearance in this blue to pink area, the landing zone, and that uh, might work great for tear exchange but it's probably allowing this lens a little extra freedom to slide around and drop down. So the, I think the key for this is trying to line this area a little bit more appropriately, and, uh, but with uh, rem trying to remember to keep enough tear exchange so it doesn't get too tight on the eye. I'd probably switch over to tangential. Uh, tangential generally gives a little bit more uh, precise um, representation of this peripheral part of the, the cornea. And then I go ahead and let Wave redesign the lens using current settings. And you'll see once Wave goes around and uh, redesigns this lens, you'll see a lens that aligns much more nicely in that pink to blue area, and you'll see that lens is very closely aligned. Um, this, in theory, should let that lens match this part of the cornea more precisely, helping to center the lens. And of course, we still have some inferior thickness, which you're not going to get away with, uh, get away from but uh, you have much better alignment in these areas. Now don't forget, uh, it sounds like your other lens was comfortable, so you probably had adequate tear exchange. This one's going to be a little snugger, so you want to make sure you raise up that pink dot uh, enough, maybe a few clicks here, just to promote some uh, enough tear exchange uh, on that lens. And with this design, uh, hopefully it'll get you lined up a little bit uh, more precisely. Well, thank you for contacting Wave, and have a great day.